Hello, everyone, and welcome back for another episode of Yakuza 0. I think we just finished, yeah, Chapter 5. Now we're going into Chapter 6, and I believe it's still Kiryu. Okay, yeah, because we're back at the bar. Ah, uh, poor Oda. Mama, Mama, that's enough. Thanks. Sorry for the trouble. Okay, yeah, because I think he's a regular there. Kiryu. Kiryu. Yeah. Smarty. Sorry, bro. I didn't do a damn thing to help you out. You Well, you can't. You're kind of... You're still in there. No, it should be me apologizing. I wouldn't have got you involved. Sorry. Hey, what are you going to do now? That Owano guy told you to give up the boss, didn't he? I want to mention it while you were busted heads downstairs. The Dojima family is kicking off an all-hands search for the president of Tachibana Real Estate. Yeah. He suggested I start trying to convince you, too. I want to make sure you know. Giving up Tachibana is the only way to get you out of this alive. Come on, the boss is going around town right now, digging up enough info to get your ass off the hook for that murder. Planning to serve his head up to Dojima on a platter? You stay out of this! Excuse you. Not Tachibana, it'll be Kiryu's head on that plate. With the whole Dojima family on the hunt, there's no escape. <laughs> but it's fine with you that Tachibana has to die. You shitheads are the ones who dragged Kiryu into this. He's off. He's been hurt, Nishiki. Besides, I already knew I'd be making an enemy of the Dojima family eventually. This happens sooner rather than later. You're seriously planning on going head to head with them? You gotta be out of your fucking mind. Oh, sorry, skip that. Yeah, you might actually have a point there. Even Tachibana was planning to have the empty lot in his pocket long before going to war with the Dojima family. The Dojima, that little plot's worth more than a billion yen. Play that trump card right, and we could buy control over a huge chunk of Kamurocho. We'd be a force even the Dojima family couldn't shuffle out of the deck so easily. But now, never figured Dojima lieutenants would force our hands this early in the game. <laughs> As I understand Awano, you can't lump him in with a brute like Kuze. He's actually pretty sharp. I don't know, they all seem not that sharp to me, but... I need to talk to the president. Mama, can I use your phone? There's gotta be some way everybody gets out of this alive. We can pin down the empty lot's owner. We get the chips to bargain with the Dojima family on our terms. God, it's been so long since I've seen like a wireless <laughs> phone, home phone. Sir, it's Oda. I'm with Kiryu in a bar called Serena. Or Serena. Yeah, sir. So then Dojima's man, Owano, told Kiryu to hand you over to them or die. That's right. They know we're after the empty lot, which is why, uh,. Sir, you need to hide. Fast. I don't think we can trust Kiryu anymore. He might sell you out to Dojima. Hey, hang on just a goddamn minute. It's fine, Nishiki. But he, yeah, whatever. <laughs> that solves that. Now even I don't know where the boss is gonna be. Shit! Well, Kiryu probably wasn't gonna give him up anyway. Nothing personal. Sorry for all the trouble, Mama. I know all that must have been frightening. You're worrying about me? Forget it. What are you going to do now? Mm, I guess just fight everyone. Hey, wait. Kiryu, what the hell are you planning? Panicking now won't get me anywhere. I knew that when I left the family that I'd be walking this path alone. On that Kuze, and then clear my name. Back to square one. Idiot. You really think you're in any position to pull that kind of stunt off now? Doesn't matter. 
Still my only option. Just beat everybody up and everything will work out. I have to clear my name, huh? Come to think of it, still haven't been back to give the empty lot a proper once-over. Cops may have cleared out by now. Could be worth going to take a look. Time to go to the empty lot! How far is the empty lot from here? Oh, not that far. Okay, yeah, it's just that little lot right off the side of the Kamuro shopping area. Might have to fight people along the way. Hopefully not, but thugs are all over the streets waiting to get a piece of the action. Hello, drunk man. Pardon me. Back to the end. Oops, sorry. Oops, oops, sorry. Uh, oh, oh yeah, you have to take a little. Wait. Sorry, I thought I saw something shiny. I mean, if I see telephone cards, I'll pick them up, but I'm not actively searching for them at the moment. Oh, that's light. I was like, is it? Oh, they didn't even clean up the blood? Jeez. <sighs> hmm. Hello? Oh! Hi! Hachibana. What's up? Oh, well, how are you doing? Tachibana. Why? What? Why? What's up? Why are you here? The police have thoroughly scoured this place top to bottom. Any evidence that may be linked to the real culprit is gone. I know that much. I have looked into Kuze using my network. If he is really the one who framed you, he must have hired a killer to perform this hit. And yet... Kuze left no sign of any such activity. Meaning what? Meaning that the one responsible for setting you up is not likely to be him. Someone other than Kuze is behind this. What? That is all the information I have at present. I wanted to pass that on to you in person. How did you know I was going to be here? You came here just to tell me that? Yes, but please do not worry. I have no intention of disappearing from Kamurocho. I did think that it would take the Dojima family a while longer to catch on to our activities, but the situation is well within expected tolerances. Oda sure didn't seem to think so. I have yet to inform Oda-san of this, Oda-san, but as it happens, I have located the owner of the empty lot. Huh? Though for various reasons, I have yet to make contact. Regardless, if we can find them and acquire the empty lot, the Dojima family will come to us, hat in hand, begging us to sell it. Oh, dang. Such is the power this lot can wield, which is why, Kiryu-san, I must insist that you stay alive until we can broker such a deal. Or does that seem an unreasonable request? How long till you can pin down the lot's owner? Give me one day. I must ask, however, that you tell no one. Not even Nishikiyama-san or Kashiwagi-san. You realize I could just sell you out to Iwano and get taken off the Dojima hit list altogether. I don't know. I don't trust him to actually do that. If you were that sort of man to do that, I certainly would not be visiting you in such a place as this. I will get in touch with you tomorrow. Until then, please stay safe and out of the Dojima family's hands, curious son. Okay. Thanks, bro. I have one day to not die. All I can do now is wait for word from Tachibana. Better head home and lie low there. But, uh, home? But don't they know where you live? I feel like they, they probably know a lot about me. Uh-oh. Boy. Oh there, buddy. Not so fast. Hello? 
who are you? You plan to just waltz past without a word? You want through here? You gotta pay a toll. Um, who are you? <laughs> what is that suit? Shakedown? I feel bad for the guy, but I can't really afford to get involved right Oi. now. Oi, you mute or something, blondie? If you don't want to get hurt, let's see some cash already. <laughs> oh, if you insist, just be sure you pick it all up, hmm? Eh? Huh? Huzzah! Hmm. Whoa! It's money! Um. Oh. Huh? Are you the one who teaches me how to just throw money on the ground? Right on, I've never seen so much dough in one place. Whoa, hey, I had my hand on that one first. Keep your grubby mitts off my dough. Shut up and move your freaking leg. Oh my, my peasants truly are a sordid sort. Um, hello? Hmm? Oh, did you want some of my money as well? No. Then I shall be on my merry way. Till next time, cheers. Wait. You always throw wads of cash just to clear the road like that? But of course, why? At the point you cough up the money, it's no different from getting mugged. Oh, I suppose commoners just can't understand. Excuse me? You see, when you're not just wealthy, but obscenely rich, physical capital is like dust. It just accumulates, gets in the way, really. That was loose change. I won't miss it. On the other hand, having my precious time wasted by base ruffians like them is a serious loss. If I can buy that time back with coin, why, I'll pay as much as it takes. Mr. Moneybags. Nice. Buying time, literally. Precisely so. Why not give it a try if you're curious? Um, give what a try? Let fly with great whopping, uh, a great whopping wad of wealth. I hate the way you said that. And I wouldn't, I'm just not that big a rush, honestly. Hmm? Truly, have you never been out on a stroll and felt the other pedestrians were in your way? Not ever? Well, sure, I guess a few times. <laughs> oh, you see? Then give it a try right now. I'm sure you'll feel the thrill of sending those human hurdles scattering. Sure, but I don't have much ca that, that much cash to burn on a whim. Not to worry, I will be your financier this one time as a special gift. You need focus only on enjoying the rush of flinging cash confetti. Oh no. This is what that shrine thing was. Okay, deal. You're really gonna pay for it. I'll give it a go. Press X while walking around the city to take a handful of your money and fling it into the air. Anyone nearby will flock to the cash and grab what they can. Keep in mind the next time you're in a hurry. Try using it to attract the women behind you. Are you kidding me? Hi, women. Would you like some money? Uh, uh -huh. On narrow streets and alleys, you'll often find your way completely blocked by punks eager for a fight. Walking around them simply isn't an option in these situations. Distracting them with a mountain of cash, however, is. They'll literally leap at the chance to fill their pockets. Give it a try now and save yourself a headache. Now simply strut past them while they're busy scrabbling over each other to pick it all up. Aha! By judiciously wasting money, you can now buy your way out of the most necessary, unnecessary conflicts. Keep in mind the next time you're in a hurry. Ah, <sighs> gosh. Fun. Mm. Oh, truly magnificent money blasting. For a moment, I completely forgot you were merely another plebeian. Mm. Is that what being rich is like? Honestly, I can't say it feels very good to waste it like that. Perhaps, but aren't there times where you're far too hurried to be embroiled in petty squabbles of the underclass? It's not, uh, okay, yeah. Right? Mm. Really, whoever said time is money is an utter buffoon. Time is far more precious resource. It's finite. <laughs> Fair enough, I can see a weird sort of logic to that. And I've made my case. Take my advice. If you're ever in danger of being dragged into a meaningless fight, just let loose with a heaping helping of legal tender. So you're clearly loaded. But how'd you earn all that cash? Oh, I take it you've caught a case of money fever, hmm? Maybe. I'm just thinking it'd be convenient if there was a quick way to make some extra money. Common sense tells me that's crazy to wish for, but I might as well ask. No, but there is. Seriously? The very epitome of high risk, high return. It's been my golden goose, and now I dine on diamond foie gras. It being. Head for the theater square. 
you're truly a man of a means, you'll find your way there. What am I looking for? Oh, you'll know it when you see it. A paradise exclusively reserved for the upper echelons of wealth and taste. Though naturally that isn't my only source of income, I have quite a diverse portfolio. I, or should I say we, put most of our capital to work in a certain system that gives rise to considerable profits. Is it a pyramid scheme? If you wish to hear more about that as well, drop by Vincent. You'll find me there most of the time. Vincent, got it. This has been the most stimulating use of my time. Ta-ta! Ha. Huh. Okay, well, Tachibana may have new intel tomorrow, but that doesn't mean everything will be over then. I should take away as much cash as I can now so I'm ready for whatever comes. Said I'd find a way to make big money at Theater Square. It's worth a look. Wait, really? This is a part of the story? I thought it was just a sub-story. Oh, the lines are blurred between story and sub-story a lot of times in this game. Uh, oh no, not that guy. Okay, I'm gonna buy it. Sorry. Look, there's a hundred sub-stories. There's no way I'm gonna get all those done. Like, this game is already like a 30-hour game <laughs> without doing the completion run. That's like 70 hours. French guy said I should be. A, I should go to Theater Square if I want to make big money. Hmm? I've been waiting all day for this. Excuse me, my good man. <laughs> hey, right this way, sir. Um, what is that? Hmm? Uh oh, beyond the door. So this is a sub story. Well, I guess we're. I guess I'm going downstairs. What's downstairs? Oh, is this the fighting ring? <laughs> Enjoy your stay. Wait, isn't there? Yeah. Where does that door go? What is this door? There's definitely something behind it. Sorry, pal. That's not open to you. I saw you let a guy in. What's in there? Eh, you think I'd come right out and say it? Well, let's just say it's a paradise for men. A place where dreams come true. A place where dreams come true. Yes, a real life wonderland. Got your interest up? Does make me curious. What do I have to do to get in? Eh, I'm the decider, actually. I say who comes in. You want in? You gotta win my approval. Hmm, all right. So what do I need to do to impress you? This place is a paradise for the wealthy. If you don't have the bread, you can't afford the dessert. I have to see what you got enough cash to make a splash. Not only that, I want to see you've got the balls to do it with style. You prove that to me, I'll let you in. Here's your noggin and figure it out. Okay. I have money to burn and the willingness to burn it. Okay, so that means I just go up to you and... Pacha! What do you think you're doing? Have you lost your mind? I'm showing that I've got cash to burn and I'm not afraid to set it on fire. Well, I never thought I'd see a guy literally toss money onto the pavement. You got a screw loose? I like the cut of your jib, though. You can come in. Right this way. I don't actually know how much money that spent, but I have 60 mil. It's... Are you kidding me? So it is a fighting ring, but it's not the kind of fighting ring that I was envisioning. What is this place? It's the official arena of the JCC, Japan Cat Fight Club. Sexy little vixens scrap it out in an arena filled with beauty and ugliness, and men bet big wages on the winner. That's what this place is about. Oh my god. The feast for the eyes, an exciting chance to double the fun by making money and laying bets. A pleasure palace for men, it's, I call it. That's what it is. Not exactly subtle, not entirely refined, but who cares? Not me. No, oh, here. Take this back. It's yours. Oh, I only threw 10,000? What's this? The catch you burned. It was a real joy to watch it floating around, so I scooped it out back up for you. Use it to have fun in here, pal. Good luck to you. Uh, yeah. Okay, so I can make money by betting on wrestling women. Cat fights, huh? Never expected to find that going on in Kamurocho. What a gaudy place. But I bet I can make money here, even with the risks. It's worth a shot. Uh, oh, nice, nice camera angle there. 
Kiri, are you good? <laughs> oh, poor guy. It's okay, Kiryu. Yay! I completed five sub stories, so now I can do the cat fights are high risk, high return. But if I play it right, it feels like I could turn a hefty profit quick. I got a new way to make big bucks. What I really need now is some sleep. Okay, so now I know how to make money. R high risk, high reward. Uh, uh, oopsie, oopsie, I got stuck. Uh, go, 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 go. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh yeah, there is a sprint button. I forgot. It's, I hold A. Okay, so I can sprint for a long time. Okay, because that was one of the CP bonuses was being able to sprint for a while. Is this where I live? Or exit? You can travel to Kiri's apartment from here. Head to the apartment. Yeah, we're dead. Sorry. As much as cat fights seem very interesting and cool, um, I got other stuff to do. Oh, am I just here? I feel like there's going to be... This feels like a bad place to be. Going home, where a lot of people know that you live there, seems terrible. Tachibon is supposed to get in touch tomorrow, but... Are really supposed to just sit here until then? May still be something I can do. I'll hit the streets for info in the morning. It's fair to expect the family will be looking for me, and if they find me, there's no getting around to fight. They'll be coming for me with guns blazing. Make sure I'm ready now before things go down. Anything left I should do before hitting the sack? Nope. Call it a night. Getting some sleep now is part of being ready for tomorrow. Here we go. The longest day. It's dawn. Kiri has not given up Tachibana. <sighs> Get me Chief Dojima on the phone. <laughs> Boss, it's a Wano. That's what we discussed. We're gonna have to end Kiri. He wouldn't sell Tashibana out. And the Dojima family doesn't tolerate ingrates. Yeah. Yeah. Got it. No objections from you, right? Kuze. You've already lost to me once, bro. I don't see why you're asking me. Your point, man, on this one. I'm just the infantry here. Good, I hope I get to punch you again. Nah, don't be like that, bro. I'm trying to make sure I treat everyone fair. Hey! Don't break it. You're probably gonna break it. You're gonna throw it. Here's a quick down. Speaking of, I assume the Kazuma family's understanding on this too. Ashiwagi-san. What do you mean by that? We wouldn't be dealing with this mess if Captain Kazuma hadn't brought Kiryu in. But the Dojima family's got to take him out now. <laughs> Only right that every last man in the Kazuma family should hunt harder than anyone else. Wow. What a dick. Am I wrong? Yeah. No, sir. Precisely as you say. Then, let the hunt begin. All right. Well, it's fine. At least I'll make a lot of money beating people up. Listen up! You find Kiryu and you bring him here. He doesn't get to die just yet. I want him alive, on his knees, in front of me. Uh, you should probably you should probably just mail out with everybody else. Yeah, yeah. Just act act chill, bro. Act chill. If I'm gonna look into the case while I wait for Tachibana to get in touch, I should stick to places without a lot of people around. And even then, I should be ready to run into Dojima's men at any moment. Okay. Oopsie! Um. 
Um, I don't know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about! <laughs> it's who? Hey, excuse me. Leave her alone. Intervene. Get into the good part. Why don't you go home before I get real mad? Waste this narc! Yeah? Excuse me. Have a bicycle. Boom. Oops. Poo! 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 Oh, I fucked up because I didn't. I forgot there's quick time events. Hit him with the bike! Hit him with the bike again! Hit him with the bike again! Hit him with that! Oh, I, I, you gotta do it really quick. Oh, you're getting mad? You're getting dead is what you're getting. Okay. That's a stupid idea. We won't do this again. That's fucking right. Can I ever thank you? Stamina Royale. Hell yeah. I, that's gonna be helpful. Speaking of which, you know what I should do? I should probably increase my abilities more if I can. Okay, that's worth a lot. What is that? Master? Okay, how much stuff? Spry Master. Okay. Why when Kiryu gets up from the ground? Oh, nice. Um, let's go blow. Regard one. I should probably increase my max health. Okay. Gosh. Hawk Spirit. Thirty million yen. It's worth it. Kerchunk. Look at that. Beast. I think I already put up my health. Yeah. You know what? Why not? Boost health. L. I'll only have one million. But it's fine. I need money. Fight me. Fight me. Fight me. Oh, these guys are kind of... Chonky. Okay, never mind. That definitely does just a ass ton of damage. I forgot how to guard. L. Or, yeah. Oopsie. And Kerchunk. See, we're already making money. Very good. Do, 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 do. Um, I can't remember what I'm supposed to do. I think I just have to kind of, a certain amount of time has to pass. I think it's kind of like when I did the real estate. Speaking of which, maybe I should go down there. Where is it again? It's 10 times two. Oh, okay. Can I go there? Am I allowed to go here? Okay, that's story. Wait, so, okay. Damn, I need to, okay. Um, oh. Wait, so I just straight up can't go that way? Okay. Um, I'm gonna go down here, because I kind of want to check some real estate stuff and also make some money. Oh, uh, this seems like a bad place to be. Uh, who's that? Who are you? Oh, some thugs. Yep. Yeah. As many guys as you can, tell them we found Kiryu. Yes, sir. You know we're safe in this city now. You gotta know how this ends for you, Kiryu. Struggling is only gonna make it worse. This place will be swarmed with Dojima crew in a minute. You're not going anywhere. I've got no backup coming, so there's no reason for me to hold back. Let's just get to the fun part. Get that that desperate to delay your execution? Pathetic, Critter. Like, shut up and swallow his medicine. No! Oh, this is a lot. Defeat your pursuer. Oh. Are you a rushy man? Oh, 
Dude, you know what? Excuse me, brawler time. Do, 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 do. Trash can. Poop, 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 poop. Padoom. Oh, hi, lady. Let me get him. Ew. Face punch. Uh, can I pick anything up? No. Oh! Take that. Salt? Am I really beating this man with a salt shaker? Okay. Uh, excuse me, pardon me, pardon me, thank you. I made some money though. Yeah, yeah. Uh, wait, uh, this way? Okay, this way. Got my safety trash can. Oh, there they are with their walkie talkies. Ah! End him. Peace, man. Yeah? <sighs> that stance. Boom, boom, boom. No. Eep, boop. Ah. Oh. Boop. <laughs> that was about to say. Okay. Woo. Right, boom, 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 boom. <laughs> okay. Uh, kind of want to move a little faster than that. Do, 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 do. Uh, great. Uh, okay, so this is just non-stop thrills and chills. One minute! Get him, get him. Lariat! Fuck you! Woo! Thanks, bye! <laughs> I have so much blood on me! It's not my blood, though! Don't worry! <laughs> you got 30 seconds! I knew it! I knew it! Excuse me. I mean, come on. Like, how am I supposed to beat them in 30 seconds? That, that's what it gets me. Okay, and now it's back up to one minute. But there's also four of them. God damn it. Ah, there's so many dudes now.
Sorry, 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 bicycle. Oh, got it that time. Oh, this, this is so annoying. Get him, get him, get him. Oh, okay, got it. Jeez. Woo. Okay. Shit, out of the way. Okay, I, I, I haven't taken too much damage at least. All things considered. Uh, I'll take that. Uh, you better not say 30 seconds again. Are you kidding me? There's so many dudes! Especially since one of them's a big guy. And even with all the punchies, Oh my god. Oh, Sledgehammer Man. Okay. At least they're not calling up any more backup. Get Sledgehammer, bro. Ah, oh, God! Go, 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 go. Pick up sign. Hi. <gasps> Get him. No. Bad. No sledgehammers. Eat action. Ugh. Excuse me. Come here, you. Not that everybody's cheering me on. Oh, jeez. Thanks, bye. Woo! Oh, come on! I just... I just... Ow. Oh, this guy has a lot of health. Nope. Boy! Up, 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 up. Uh. Ow. Uh. Ow. Ow. Okay, so beast mode does a lot of damage, but also just there's a bunch of dudes. Okay. Oh, he knocked me down, but it's okay. Get him. God, that didn't do nearly as much as I would like. You know what? Crawler mode.
And... Hey! Thanks for the money. Come on, one last heat action to finish. Give me that third. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, I doubled my money with that fight. Holy hell. Okay, this has to be. I think, I think. Oh, uh oh. Oh, those are school kids. Wait, okay, where are we at now? Did I lose them? Can't give this up forever. There's too many of them. Nah. Hey. <sighs> Yakuza are after you, aren't they? You stay out on the streets like that and they'll find you in no time. If you want it, you could step inside the club a while. What? <laughs> the floor plan's a little unconventional. Back down door leads right into the sewers. You can get out from this part of town without anybody seeing you. Why are you helping me? Because it's the Dojima family who's after you. Those assholes think they own this town. You won't find one honest person in Kamurocho who doesn't hate those lowlifes. Besides, it'd be a waste to let the Yakuza take out a hot young stud like you. Thanks. Uh, <coughs> th thank you? But hey, if you got a better offer, by all means. Being able to move around underground would be huge. Can I trust her? It could be a trap, but I don't have many options. All right, lead the way. This way, sugar. And step lively before they catch us. Yay! God bless strippers. Ooh, what's this? What's that? Ooh. Okay, this way? Woo! So we just go directly into the sewers? Holy crap, it's literally the sewers! You aren't kidding about this place being unconventional. What do you need access to the sewers for? I heard the previous owner wasn't exactly the upstanding businessman type. I don't know what he was so afraid of, but he wanted a quiet escape route. Stinks, but them's the brakes. Where does it lead? In Theater Square, apparently. Never bothered to check myself. But it's got to connect back to the street level somewhere. Not my use as a secret passage otherwise. By now, the Dojima guys are probably all parked outside the club looking for you. Use this passage to pop up somewhere else and you'll probably throw them off. Let's hope. And thanks. I owe you for this. Once I can walk around Kamurocho without being hunted down, come back as a paying customer. Wow. That's a man that keeps his word, too. Sorry, stud. I don't think that day is coming. Oh, no! Was she, did she actually lie? Oh, no! Oh, no! I think I run into somebody down here. But I don't... Oh, no, yeah. Oh, boy. Why would you have motorcycles in the sewers? Yep, Kuze, that piece of shit. <laughs> you dumbass! That's why you don't ride a motorcycle in the sewers! <laughs> I hate this man. He's the worst. Oh, you're gonna get dirty shit water in your, in your freaking... Cut off Pinky, bro. You asshole. You're making this fun. God, this guy sucks. Yeah. Hmm. 
So that woman was one of yours. I'll let you in on a little something. The Yakuza game, it's not like boxing. The man who gets beat down isn't the loser. The guy who can't tough it out in the end, he's the one that loses. Is that your way of saying that you didn't lose the last, like, couple of times that I fought you? Eh? Don't you think? You're the one that hit me with a metal pipe going like 50 miles an hour. In the Yakuza life, there are no KOs. I'll tell you what, Kiryu. To me, finger or two don't mean shit. Really? Having a Wano Shibu Sawa beat me to the captain spot? Couldn't give a fuck. Yeah? As long as I'm alive, I'll keep getting back up for more. Which is why you... Half-ass like you use the one thing I can't stand. Now die, you little shit. No. How are my arms not broken? Honestly, this guy sucks. Okay, first things first. Um, uh, charges up your heat and everything dramatically. ZZ, ZZ. Do I have any, like... Okay. This light. Up to Z. Stamina. Okay, very good. Uh, also, equipment. I currently have... Oh. Modified high voltage batteries make it possible to run super high voltage electricity through these. Okay, attack 190. Still not as good as this card. Custom made business card is made of steel and a grape. Yeah. <laughs> God, I gotta say, kicking this man is fun. Unfortunately, my business card just broke. Um, can't equip. He can't use nunchucks. Ordinary piece of wood you can find anywhere. Okay. Oh, table salt compliant enemies. Master ball. Punk! Master Ball. Ow. Oh. Oh, uh, up, 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 up. Fuck. You, Kuse. My ball! Heat gauge. Punch. Equipment. Oh, my ball's gone. Um, I can use a gun. Oh, I, I can't use gun. Pew, pew. Pew. Duh, duh, duh. Pew, 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 pew. Pew. I'm surprised there wasn't like a half health cutscene. Oh. Put that away. Brawler time. Oh. Oh. Get him! No! Ho ho! Bob! Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Oh, 
Ugh. He gets up too quick for me to use heat actions. Ow. Now get him! Now punk! He is kind of like a roach. He just keeps getting up. Oh, he's doing something. Or maybe he was just taunting me. <laughs> Get out of here, Kuze. Don't drown in the poopy water. <sighs> Fucking shit. Hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him, hit him. Although you're not the kind of person to do that because <laughs> you're not a piece of shit like him. Bye, Kuze. Have fun down here. Get back here. No. You'll regret this. Not killing me here when you got the chance. <laughs> it's like you said before. Couldn't hack it as a Yakuza. I guess Kazuma-san knew that. Knew it before I ever started. That's why he didn't want me joining up. Hmm? Really, Yakuza, though. Probably someone more like you. But even a guy like me has got his own brand of pride. And I plan on sticking to it. Ha ha ha! you, you little. Yeah? Yeah. No matter how many times you stand up in my way. <laughs> oh, doesn't that make you feel real good, Kuze? Okay, yeah. There you go. Hello? <laughs> oh, my poor suit. And now I'm all stinky and wet and gross. Where am I? Am I under a club? The disco? Um. Where is this? Oh, it's a disc. Oh, what is happening? Um. Oh, no. It's. Of course it's him. Of course it's him. It's like. It's just like. What? Yeah. Been waiting for you, Kiryu. Figures Kuze would come up short again. What are you doing? Use your eyes. I'm dancing. I mean, I can see that. Yeah. What the hell is this game? So, how come you didn't call me yesterday? He had me waiting by the phone all night. Don't just stand there looking bored, kid. <laughs> Get your skinny ass over here. Dance with us, Kiryu. <laughs> okay. Is that a joke? Aren't you trying to kill me? If we're done here. I'm going. I don't have time to play with you. Okay. Ah, hang on, Kiryu. I'm real grateful to you, you know. Grateful? Both Captain Kazuma and Lieutenant Kuze, you've given me the ammo to take down two guys who've been standing in my way a long time. 
As far as I'm concerned, you're my lucky charm. I don't like him. I don't like any of them. That's my angle here, Kiryu. I want to help you out. Repay a little of that debt. Uh-huh. Besides, it's not like you got anywhere to run once you cut out of here. Why not hear me out first? <sighs> yes. What now? It's supposed to be really awkward for that girl. Alright, talk. You know, I was thinking about a little while back, maybe just after you and Kuze threw down the first time. I went golfing. Koshu Country Club. Friggin' gorgeous course. What's your point? You may not know this, but the food these golf course these golf spots serve is fan fucking tastic. Eighteen holes and curry and sauna. Once you taste that, the rest of the world's pleasures start feeling like a joke. I'm not sticking around to talk hobbies. Get to the point. Still young and impatient, you know? The world's chock full of shit that don't seem like it has any connections to anything. And then it turns out it's real important in the long run. Anywho, so I was coming back from golf and I took a little detour. Visited you in Nishikiyama's old place. No. After hearing Kazuma was looking after the joint, I figured it'd be nigh palatial, but nope. It's more like a kennel. Sunflower orphanage. Geezer running it seemed lively for his age. Bastard, what did you do to the sunflower? Whoa there, down boy, relax, I ain't done a thing. I told him I worked with Kazuma and gave him some pocket change. Maybe a million. The guy started crying. Sweet old man, that caretaker. I wonder why I swear. <laughs> You wouldn't want to make an innocent guy like that sad because of something you did, would you? Oh, God, these guys suck. Am I being direct enough? Even if you make it out of here alive today, you got nowhere else to run. I know every little thing about you, about your friends, where you live, where you grew up, even your favorite ramen joint. Look, it's nothing personal. Dojima family's always split up the responsibilities. Uh-huh. Kazuma family writes the script, Kano clans the muscle, boring paperwork's Shibusawa's game, and me? Public relations. Extortion's my department. Kiryu, I ain't like the old Kuze. Or I ain't like old Kuze. Couldn't give two damp shits about living like a proper Yakuza. I want to eat good food, wear nice clothes, and blast down the highway in a sweet-ass car. If I got a hot girl during that, so much the better. Being Yakuza is a career for me, a job, my means to enjoy the sweet life. <clears throat> Come over to my side, Kiryu. You give me that real estate bump, Tachibana, and you're on the winning team. Set for life on Easy Street. And if you don't, you'll die a painful, pointless death. Oh, okay. They won't let me skip past that. <laughs> you only just clawed your way out of that kennel with Nishikiyama, Nishikiyama right? No reason to throw your life away now. <laughs> right? Um. Oh, cutscene. Is it time for... Fuck you. That's your idea of extortion? What are you? Jimmy. Fuck wad. What a joke. <clears throat> wow, <laughs> he's just like, bye. <sighs> whoa, 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 wait. Did you, why? Why? What? Why? 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 <laughs> You're about to join her. Wow, you suck. 
I got a hundred Jojo my boys parked out front. All of them packing heat. Wow, this guy's wow, they all suck. This may just be a job, but I'm thorough with my work. So, what's your move, Kiryu? Waltz out there and get ventilated? Or come and chase the dream with me. That call is yours to make. What's it gonna be? <sighs> no decision to make. I'm out of here. <clears throat> what? <laughs> you may think he's shaking me up. But I don't care if I live or die. You're full of dog shit. You make your choices based on what's fun or not. <laughs> me? I decide based on whether I love it or hate it. And I hate you. <laughs> I'm going, and the reason's simple. I hate the idea of joining a guy like you. Oh, holy shit! Here, you cocky shit! Oh, he's so good! In fact, I'd rather get shot. Holy fuck! Kiri was so great! God damn! Is this the end of chapter? Is this gonna be the chapter end? Is me going up to leave and... Oh. Holy shit. He was bluffing! He was fucking bluffing! Okay, but anyway... Uh, he still has a gun down there. I'd, I'd get a move on. Okay, so he was bluffing. But he also did totally kill that girl. Wow. What a fucking piece of shit. <sighs> yeah. Threats don't work on a goddamn idiot. Should have seen that coming. Oh, <laughs> yeah! Hell yes! Oh, that's so great! Well, Kiryu don't like you, bro. <laughs> I'm just gonna get the fuck out. Uh-oh! Don't get hit by car! Oh! Get in! We're boned if anyone sees you. Okay. But, uh, just get in. Okay. Up. Oh, okay. Okay. Keep your head down and stay low. Okay, bye. <laughs> Hope I'd run into you if I shattered a Wano. I got lucky. Nishiki, you understand what you're doing. Get involved and you'll be a target too. Shut up! This is the last time I can help you out. They've got every inch of the city covered. Right now we gotta get you out of Kamurocho. Where are we going? Out of Tokyo, for starters. Won't keep you safe, but it'll buy us some time. Is that... End of chap? Nope, nope, we're still going. Okay, okay, so... Can I get up now? Oh, I'm in the front seat now. Sleepy boy. It's been a very long day of punching and getting punched. Bro, where are we? Bro, what is this? Bro? Bro? Where where are we? We're here, Kiryu. Hmm? Must have fallen asleep. What the hell is this? This is like a horror movie, bro. Bro, where are we? Nishiki, yeah. Where are we? You know. Just kinda kept driving. Well, fun. Cool. Want one? Yeah, thanks. Uh. I'm still bogarting it. Oh! <laughs> Ah. <sighs> yeah, are you? 
Keep it. I won't ask for it back again. That's so? Oh, boy. Bro, what's going on? Sure to savor it. Brother. Oh, he's got... Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. That's your last smoke. Make it count. What are you doing? Isn't this going a little far for a prank? <laughs> Come on, bro. Put that thing away. It's too late. This is the only way. How did it come to this, man? When did everything get so fucked? I don't know, when you joined the Yakuza? Are these the family's orders, Nishiki? They got nothing to do with it. Hmm? Kiryu. You know what they do to guys who fuck with the family. Dojima's crew are the experts when it comes to making examples. They know exactly how bad you can torture a guy before he goes. And they make damn sure that it lasts. They'll keep you clinging on. Make it hurt as bad as long as possible. Make you watch while they dissect you. Then when they've broken the last little part of you, the bodies of these guys they find. You can't even tell they're human anymore. I can't let them do it, Kiryu. Oh. Mere sworn brother, I'm not watching you die like that. Well, it's not going to happen. That's what it means to cross the Dojima family, Kiryu. <clears throat> Once they're after you, you can never be free. There's no statue of limitations in the Yakuza. You know that. At this point, I'm through as a Yakuza too. And Kazuma's son with us, but at least... At least I can keep you from dying in pain. Bro. I can end it for you. I can make it quick. That's all I can do. Oh. <sighs> oh, drop the cigarette. Bro. You really think I'm going to die? I'm sorry, bro. It's my fault you're being put through this. Actually, it's kind of the fault of uh, whoever set everything up. Brother. I've got one request. After you plug me, bring my head back to them. Use it to fight your way to the top of the clan. Promise me. I don't think he can do that. It's up to you now. I don't think he can do it. What the hell? Don't look at me. Don't look at me, Kiryu, please. Yeah, that's... Yeah. Man the fuck up and do it. You can't get to the top by crying. Uh... Dosta. Dosta. What's the problem? Aim carefully. Kiryu! you am not dead yet. I, I don't think he can do it. I... Yeah. Can't do it. Oh. How could I shoot you? Yeah. Well, I mean, Kiryu, you have to understand. Oh. That you will always be nothing. Uh. Can't make it as a Yakuza. No. I wouldn't even still be alive now if I didn't have you beside me. 
Just, if you're not with me, I'm useless. Nothing means anything. Me too. We're the same. Oh, that means we're both still just kids. Well, you guys are still fairly young in this. Getting caught up in something way over our heads. Making trouble for Kazuma-san. Thinking we can die and make it all better. Forget about whether I had what it took to be a Yakuza. I wasn't even a man yet. Look at me. Talking all cool about ending it for you quick? So fucking pathetic. Seriously. But we can't stay kids forever. Here, you and me, together we could. Forget you saw me today. I'll forget all of this too. I've got to go. Where, where are you gonna? Back to Kamurocho. There's still work I need to do there. You, you can't, Kiryu. They'll, they'll kill you for sure. No, this is the life you just gave me. I want to see for myself how far I can take it. Nishiki. Let me do what I have to do. Mess that up, sorry. You and I end here. From this moment on. We're no longer sworn brothers. I don't want you having anything to do with me. I mean, that's the best way to keep him from getting, like, in more trouble. Oh, are you going to leave him? Are you just going to leave him there? Well, I mean, bye. Okay. Well. Oh, man. Holy shit. Well, I feel like that is probably the end of the chapter. Thanks. I got 30 million. Holy shit. This game. We're 24 times grand pianos. That's a lot of grand pianos. Holy crap. Well, oh, okay. Well, Get a recap again on <laughs> on Majima. But in the shadow of the neon lights, Majima's fate is held in the vice grip of a man named Sagawa. Yeah, he's kind of a dick. Money. Three years ago, Majima was a Kamurocho Yakuza. But when he defied his boss's orders, he was erased from the family, tortured, and banished. Now, as the price of his return to the Yakuza, Sagawa orders him to perform a hit. Ah, oh, Makoto. The name of Majima's target. Ma Makoto Makimura. But when other Yakuza appear to threaten her, he saves her. Majima finds himself protecting the life he was hired to end. Yeah, and it's like, why though? Why was I hired for this? There's no tolerance for killers who cannot kill. And his choice will surely have consequences. Oh, man. It's kind of weird that they have the recap um, right there before the save instead of after the save but that's fine but this is where we're going to end it so we'll start up fresh on chapter seven and see uh how things are going with uh mr majima but holy crap that was a lot uh, thank you all as always for being here and hanging out it has been this game is insane but i've been loving it 
no matter what curveballs it throws at you, or if I'm pretending to be somebody's boyfriend, or having to take somebody out to the disco, or just doing lots of strange things for the main story or a side stories. But yeah, you guys have a fantastic rest of your day, and I'll see you for the next Yakuza Zero video.